Congratulations! Those look awesome! How does an organization define its legacy? Is it the number of people it serves? The way a team member makes someone feel? The way a volunteer has the opportunity to change someone's life? Or is it a feeling? The feeling that something uniquely special is being done? Abana was founded by a group of college students who raised $156 to buy groceries for those in need. As they delivered the groceries to a family who just happened to be refugees, they started asking, who is this family? What makes them different? And where's their support system? Upon further research, these college kids learned just how many gaps exist for refugee families when they come to the United States. Equipped with new knowledge and full of fire, our founding group, Usman Rashid, Rimza Abdul Wahid, Saida Omar, Rahil Ramadan, and Ghulam Kehar, decided to do something about it. That's how we were founded, by kids in their teens and 20s who decided that they were the ones to make a difference. Amana's early days were filled with events, distributions, friendships, and a fair share of trial and error. As refugees poured in from Iraq, Bhutan, Burma, the Congo, and more, families came to us for food, household necessities, and utility help. And the heart of Amana shined through, because together our volunteers and supporters were there to answer the needs of our neighbors. With you, and the resettled community, we grew. And one day someone asked, if Amana thought bigger, what could be accomplished? If Amana didn't have limitations, what could be done? This was our pivotal question. Our pace quickened. We listened to our refugee clients, we researched needs, we developed ways to impact more deeply while building processes and structure to sustain and scale. Our short-term support initiatives came to an end, but what emerged was something much more powerful. Transformed. Meeting the unmet needs of women-led households to assist them in reaching long-term self-sufficiency. The Awesome Academy. Tutors working alongside children in their classrooms to make sure they get the academic support Coaches working alongside athletes to build their confidence and skill, and mentors encouraging them as they grow into community leaders. Today, your support comes alive in our programs, and it's alive in our moments of connection. It's alive when a Rock the Block bag is delivered and you're invited in for tea. When you spend time with a child at Pink and Blue and you're greeted with laughter. It's friends coming together for Tough Mudder, home transformations, and rays of change. 10 years of service is a chapter in the book. Our legacy is not yet defined, and every action and good deed is just a building block for what our legacy will one day be. As a community, we must continually step up and show our care for the resettled refugee population. That's just who we are. And our clients, the resettled refugees, give that in return through their words, their smiles, and their dreams. We're in this together, and because we are, thousands more lives, including ours, will be changed in years to come. This is community. This is Amana.